Hey, good morning. Hey, howdy. I got a story for you, and man, you're going to like it, I think. So there I was talking to my wife, and she goes, hey, I want a new electric car. She can ask that. She's been married to me forever, and she has suffered. So I thought, how can I do that? Not enough room, not enough power. What am I going to do? This is what we're talking about today. So, what do you do when you want to add something that really draws a decent amount of power, but you don't have a big panel, right? Or, a lot of people, man, we live in apartments or townhouses, condos, and we don't have a big husky panel like Hal, okay? Lucky people that have somebody like Hal. No, sometimes we've got Homer. Yeah, he looks sad. But here's the thing. A lot of times you've got some 220 circuits in here in, the, in one of these smaller panels, but you don't have room. And a lot of times the place you live, the apartment complex, the association, they're not going to let you upgrade this. Okay? Not going to happen. So what do you do? So I came across this. You may have seen it. If you have, let me know. Uh, simple switch, 240. Here's what it does. This thing lets us share a 220 circuit between two loads. So let's say in here that we had a 220 circuit here and it was for the oven. And we don't use the oven that much, let's just say. We could take that circuit, run it through the simple switch, let it continue to the oven, but then also run to my wife's electric car charger. So here's what happens. Instead of just tripping the breaker or sharing the circuit, maybe creating a dangerous situation, as long as I'm charging the car and that um, oven's not on, it runs, it charges. Here's what happens. Once the oven gets turned on, it shuts off the charger, lets us cook. When we're done, it switches back. So it's kind of cool. Yeah, there's a prioritizing, but on the other hand, you're not having to upgrade your panel or just say, let's wait till we move to a bigger house and we can get a super cool panel like hell. Okay? So, and in my case, keeping my wife happy, eh, it's worth it. So you're probably saying, what's inside of the, that magic box? I want to show you. So bear with me as I open this. I don't think I have the right screwdriver. So we'll do it old school. There we go. So the people who are in this company are fantastic. Small company startup. I want to say they're out of Washington State. Delightful to deal with. So here we go. Let's open up this bad boy so you can see what's in it. So here's what we got. Very interesting. It is basically a digital uh, double pole, double throw switch for the electrician people out there watching. So what we have is uh, the first two terminals are from our original circuit. We'll say the oven circuit in this case. Uh, the next two terminals uh, are going out to the oven, and the last two are going to our new thing. Again, this could be an EV charger, it could be a spa, it could be power for a mini split out in a garage or an extra room. So there's a lot of potential for this. It's, and it's, it's a simple device. And in my research, I've seen some other um, versions of this by other companies. But I like this. It's, it's simple. Um, it's more reasonable. And when you compare the cost of this to doing an entire panel upgrade, even if you could, it's, uh, it's for the most part, it's a big win. So... Um, this is what I'm suggesting if you've got, again, limited uh, breaker box capacity. Um, and this, you know, to be honest, you could even use this if you already had a big husky panel like hell, but you were maxed out. Okay, you were already like, oh my gosh, we're, we're done. And of course, when you say we're done is when somebody says, hey, can we, you know, get another Tesla or another uh, Ford Mustang charger in here? You know, and of course, you say, no, no, you can't, can't have that. And then they, they start talking to you and make you feel bad. Why not? You're supposed to be able to do things, blah, blah, blah. You know what I'm saying. Here you go. Okay? Same power. You get to prioritize it, sort of have some choices. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you guys, if you, some of you are watching this, do you have the apartment complex slash condo townhouse panel? Because um, we've run into this where people wanted to do, especially an EV charger, 
They couldn't. So you'll have a great day. Click like, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.